Kill me and you already know what it is. And if you don't, pause the video right now. Smack shout your mind. If you make this video on smash that like button. Back with another video. Back with another b -b -b banger, man. But this time we got Samson the Sixth Sense. Now, Samson been gone since the whole last year after he did 46 equals 13. If I'm not mistaken. But we about to hop right into this because a lot of people have been telling me to check this out on live. So I wanted to do a separate video on its own like I always do. Because usually nobody wants to go through two hour, three hour live stream and look for shit. So here we go. Samson automatically deserve a like, right? Fellow Americans, good morning. Certain dates echo. This was January 6th, right? January 6th insurrection. Yep. January 6th attack on the United States Capitol. The January 6th Capitol insurrection. January 6th. January 6th. January the 6th. January 6th. Including dates that instantly remind all who have lived through them where they were and what they were doing when our democracy came under assault. These clear acts of sedition and violence and terrorism. A violent terrorist attack on the Capitol. Such an attack on our democracy. Violent attack to overthrow an election. The worst attacks in American history. If I can't have it my way, I'll burn the whole country down. Dates that occupy not only a place on our calendars, but a place in our collective memory. December 7th, 1941. September 11th, 2001 and January 6th, 2021. Oh, shit. News flash, nobody gives a fuck about it. <laughs> we all admit that shit was pretty dumb, but that's about it. Right. When we saw the news, we were shocked and we were kind of tense. Like, damn. Then we forgot about it by the 10th. Damn. Nobody's walking around stressing over Jan 6. It happened and that was it. We haven't gave a damn sense. Mm. It's oh, all good. I like how he did that. He said, nobody gives a fuck about Jan 6. Stressing over Jan 6. It happened and that was it. We haven't gave a damn sense. It haven't gave a damn sense. It's all good when riots are kept in the hood, but now you're freaking out because this was in the neck of your woods. Now it's a big deal. Now it gets real. Now it's important to us. Not back then in 2020 when stores were boarded up. Ooh. Not back then when goods were looted and folks were brutalized. Right? Not then, but right now, because it happened to the suit and ties. Huh. That shit's way above my head. We were fucking shit up all year with demonstrations that left dozens dead. But Damn. people like Nancy didn't flinch. In fact, they loved it then. People will do what they do. Bitch, ain't that what you said? Oh my God, that's exactly what she said. Nancy put fucking Lucy. Yo, he came in straight up telling the real facts. Like, oh, I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let them, I'm gonna let them shoot themselves in the foot and then I'm gonna just come back with all the facts. Lies, not then, but right now, because it happened to the suit and, and ties. Huh. That shit's way above my head. Yeah. We were fucking shit up all year with demonstrations that left dozens dead. But mm. people like Nancy didn't flinch. In fact, they loved it then. People will do what they do. Bitch, ain't that what you said? Damn. Yeah. There's literally compilation videos of you and all your colleagues inciting this kind of crap so it's very fascinating to watch you swallow your words you put your own foot in your mouth and now you're forced to dial it back damn it's you encourage it in my town and his town and her town when the whole fucking city's being burnt down you smile as you give the green light for mobs to rob shit but as soon as it comes close to you then it's a problem yeah. wow soon as the problems get to you that's a problem but why it's happening in the hood, happening in everybody's towns and shit. You just saying people just going to do what they do, right? But as soon as it happened in your neck of the woods, it's like, all right, let's, it's time to, it's time to come correct at this. You know what I'm saying? Like, this shouldn't even be nowhere near my house. No protests or none of that type of shit. You feel me? That shit is wild. They don't give a fuck about us. And y'all keep thinking it's always about race and always about color and always about religion and shit like that. We already going to be flunked the fuck out, lost in the motherfucking sauce. So we got to get it together. We got to unite. Like, you can hate me all you want. You can disagree with me all you want. But we got to agree on one thing. We got to be united. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, this is how they're trying to keep us all stuck in one mindset. A slavery mindset without making us feel like we're slaves. Come on, y'all. Get the fuck together.
Get the fuck together. videos of you and all your colleagues inciting this kind of crap. So right. it's very fascinating to watch you swallow your words. You put your own foot Putting in your, your mouth, mouth and now you're forced to dial it back. Hmm. It's fine when you encourage it in my, my town, town, in his town, in her town, when the whole fucking city's being burned, burned down. down. Smile as you give the green light for mobs to rob shit. But as soon as it comes close to you, then it's a problem. Got oh, it. I got it. I don't Ew. condone what happened on that day, especially the officers that were assaulted. I would never dare. Mm. But as for all the politicians that were there, you fuck us over all the time so don't expect us to care i care <laughs> more about the store owner that's getting beat down if right his shop just for trying to protect his place of business he would probably help me if he saw me on the ground dying y'all wouldn't do a damn thing shit you probably say good riddance you oh right my over me. god they definitely would they wouldn't even give a fuck they wouldn't give a fuck about you at all bro because you're not you're not may caliber you know i'm saying you're not one of them elites so they don't give a fuck about you, you know what I'm saying? They don't give a fuck about me. They see me down there with somebody beating my ass right now. They're going to be like, oh, excuse me. Have a good one. You guys be careful. Like, what the fuck? Can I get a helping hand? Can I get a fucking helping hand? It's over all the time, so don't expect us to care. I care more about the store owner that's getting beat down in front of his shop just for trying to protect, to protect his, his place, place of business. business. He would probably help me if he saw me on, on the ground. ground dying. Y'all wouldn't do a damn thing. Shit, you probably say good riddance. You walk right over me like I was a crack, and you were trying to save your mother's back like a five-year-old kid. Oh! <laughs> I remember those days. Y'all remember those days back in the day? Your friend used to be like, you step on that crack, gonna break your mama back. Yo, I used to be afraid and shit to step on cracks, bro. I used to be bitching, but I like how he used that. I like how he used that. I like how you use that as an instance. For me like I was a crack and you were trying to save your mother's back like a five-year-old kid. If you did acknowledge me, you probably nudge my body and go, huh? Little fucker must have died of COVID. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Little fucker must have died of COVID. Yo, no way. No way, Samson. Bro, I can't wait to meet this dude one day, bro. Like, his mind... Like, I love rappers that really stand on they shit. You feel me? This one of my other white boys right here, man. He talked that shit. I'm trying to raise everybody's consciousness to understand that they're against us, people. The people of the United States that really stand for this shit. Canada, all that, bro. All in this together. They showing us that in Ottawa right now. The truckers are going and do this convoy whether anybody like it or not it's simple crack and you were trying to save your mother's back like a five-year-old five kid. kid if you did acknowledge me you probably nudge my body and go huh little fucker, fucker must have died of COVID. covid you know it's true stop bluffing all right they do absolutely nothing that is trusting kamala for you to compare this to pearl harbor and 9 11 is disrespectful and fucking disgusting mm. that's the most self-centered thing that i've ever seen compared to those events it's not even worth remembering damn no one that i know is even still paying attention to it we all forget this shit in like a month if nobody mentioned it yep and you know it too uh -huh. you're gonna milk this thing and squeeze it till it's bone dry and it won't drip any juice Woo. Like stupid committees wasting money convicting people from a year ago i'll see and then runs continuous loops. Yep. We would rather hear you address a million other issues. We don't want to listen to you cry. Get a fucking tissue. Damn. So things could be dealt with in a jiff, but you would rather sit in front of us and smell your own shit. I re <sighs> that boy is talking greasy. Because y'all don't give a fuck about it. So Samson going to come right at you with the facts. He not being around a bus and he not saying nothing else. He's telling you the truth and how it is. Be dealt with in a jiff, but you would rather sit in front of us and smell your own shit. shit. I refuse to show concern for a group of people that I have no respect for. I won't go there. I'm not happy about it. I'm not mad about it either. I'm just neutral on the issue. I just don't care. Back. Hey, hey, shout out to Samson, man. He say he's back. He about to take the fuck over. The real is back, man. Make sure y'all subscribe to his channel, man. That was six cent right there by Samson. Yo, if you guys enjoyed this reaction video, drop a like, comment, subscribe if you guys enjoy Samson. 
on the channel as always drop a like comment and subscribe man if you're here on the premiere man you guys already know i appreciate it a lot my y'all probably doing y'all thing man i appreciate each and every single one of you guys that was in here for me from the beginning if you guys still didn't enjoy the chill fam mafia membership the 499 one you get to see all behind the scenes pictures of everything and just know by march it's gonna be it's gonna be crazy i'm gonna be giving out tips on how to start your own youtube how to do so much with, with so little you feel me and you already know what it is man it's your boy chill rock in the fucking building man and i am out